Hello, I'm Diane and great to have you join me once again on Extra. Today we talk to a father who is raising awareness on cerebral palsy and also we catch the highlights of the Wedding Expo 2016. But first, Constance Karewa was at the alumni event for the James Cook University and others. It's kind of a different thing that you will learn. You just want to make a difference. Contributes to knowledge. What do you do with it? Obtaining education and getting qualified in a certain field of work is one's objective when he or she starts his or her education, especially at university level. And also achieving those goals and dreams in being educated, especially as a Papua New Guinean that is studying overseas and in this case in Australia. The extra team were at a networking event for the PNG Australia Alumni Association with former scholars and recipients of the Australian government sponsorship and self-sponsored that studied at universities in Australia. This is a networking event and, it, and, and such we call a small game. It was an event where former recipients met up with old colleagues. <laughs> This year, we have representatives from 29 organisations involved in education in Australia. 26 of those are universities. And also with others who took up studies in various universities in Australia during a speed networking icebreaker activity. It's uh, a networking. Uh, between uh, PNG Australian Alumni Association and Austrade. And Austrade is a cluster of, uh, of, uh, as a, of uh, Australian universities coming here to promote uh, opportunities for further education in Australia. And it, it's also uh, you know, a way with, to inform Papua New Guinea who wishes to, to, to undertake further studies. But I think it's also because uh, we are in, also in the process, uh, the, the uh, Australian Award, PNG Awards in here, is in a process of, uh, of uh, going through interview to, to, to uh, come up with uh, candidates for studies in Australia. The PNG Australia Alumni Association has been in existence for over 10 years and the purpose of the association is to have a network amongst former recipients and scholars in order to share the experience with others that search for such opportunity. And importantly, build an interest and partnership for Papua New Guineans, especially in education. The extra team caught up with former scholars and recipients of the Australian government sponsorship and self-sponsored that studied in Australia during the networking event of the PNG Australia Alumni Association to share their experience while studying down south. I come from Yangaroo in East Sipik. I'm a secondary school teacher by profession. My name is Rockland. I come from Wabi. But I've gone into human resource. I went to uh, University of Technology Sydney to do my master's in property development. Basically looking after the workforce in the country. I've done my master's in agriculture at the University of Queensland. And uh, I, I, was, I was in uh, UTS for two years. I'm not based here in Mosby, I'm based in Lae. I'm the vice president of the PNG AAA Lay chapter. And um, my experience in Australia was really good because it has actually landed me where I am today. So it's grateful to be part of this. Um, and I, um, the award is one of the awardees back then. I was awarded the scholarships back in 2007, took on the scholarship 2008 and 9. And my experience was the most awesome thing that has ever happened in my life so um, thanks to the Australian government and I'd like to encourage lay residents to I mean those who are alumni members and not financial members to come forward and pay your 75 kina and be members of this exciting alumni chapter. I studied international business at RMIT University. Um, it's been a great opportunity to, to be able to go down and 
I'm studying in Australia and um, it just you come back with a whole new perspective um, about life and um, and and the way you know you think as well and you just want to make a difference from the experience that we've taken from Australia you we come back thinking how can we you know change PNG and I think that's to me was one of the most important things that I've, I've, I've come back with not only the, the qualification that I have gained but the experience The evening also gave opportunities for universities in Australia to showcase and display what they can offer in terms of courses to Papua New Guineans who want to study in Australia. There's nothing like catching up with old friends from school. Coming up after the break, a family making something positive out of a health challenge. <laughs> 